I, I, I really can't believe that just happened. I, I came to this area, um, to chain either Pseudo Widow or Giraffe Rig, uh, just because they're, um, Pokemon that I've never really raced before, and they're both for, um, they're both mainly from, you know, the Gold and Silver era, so I thought it'd be pretty cool to raise them for my Shining Team in Hard Gold, and, um, the 6% Nidorino appeared, so I was like, eh, why not, might as well chain him, um, very first try, because this was my first chain, again, and my last one was Togepi, in a 1-0 <laughs> patch, Shiny Nidorino appears. Holy cow! <laughs> oh man, I forgot to switch my Pokemon. Um, he can't hurt himself or run, and his catch rate is kinda easy. I'm thinking about just throwing a couple Pokeballs first. If I need to, I'll switch for um, Derpy and Super Fang him a couple times. I do have uh, some Ultra Balls if I want, but I'm going to try a Pokeball. He should be an easy catch. Well, not easy, but not that tough. One, two, three. First ball! Oh, man. Okay. Um, I'm. He was really, really quick to appear after I got to 40. So I got to 40 like, um, like two minutes ago. Um, man, that's awesome. Poison Pin Pokemon. He's going to be such an awesome addition to the all shiny game. It's a violent disposition and stabs foes with its horn, which oozes poison upon impact. I really wanted him. Um, well, the reason I actually started chaining him is because he's one of the Pokemon who can learn Super Fang, um, but it's only through uh, Move Tutor and Heart Gold Soul Silver, and it's really expensive to get it, but. I'll do it anyway, just because I need a Pokemon who can catch Shinies. But the problem with Nidorino for catching Shinies... Just let me name him really quick. Um, oops. Darn it. I think my calibration's off. just kind of wanted to name him Rex. Let's watch for a Shiny Patch. Nope. But it is safe to run in this row. And... Let's check this guy first, because I'm really worried he's going to have Poison Point, and if he does, then this is going to be, um, he'll be a really tough one to catch Shinies with, because I'd be paranoid they're going to poison themselves, even if I have Super Fang. Um, Quiet, okay. Um, I think that raises a special attack, which is actually bad. And he has Poison Point. Um... Well, I'm going to keep looking for another one, because this appeared really quickly. Um, hopefully I can find one with Rivalry, even though a Nido King with Rivalry is really not that great, considering how most Pokemon you tend to fight by trainers are male. So it would actually power him down a bit. Um, rivalry wouldn't take effect if I'm trying to catch a Legendary, which would really be helpful. A Poison Point would just paranoid me. Uh, give me paranoid to no end if I was trying to catch a shiny. Um, that and I don't think quiet's good for him. I'm pretty sure that's high special attack and um, lowered speed. So if that's the case, I'm gonna look for another one. Um, probably name them all the same thing, then, or just give them all different names. I for some reason when I got to forty, I was like, oh, I didn't think I'd get him. I guess I'd name him like Rex or something. <laughs> well, um, I'm gonna keep looking. Uh, it was safe to run in that row I was in, so I'm going to keep doing that. Hopefully we can find another shiny Nidorino. You've got to be freaking kidding me. I should have just been filming that. A another shiny patch just appeared. I just turned the phone off like a second ago. Okay, not a second ago, but seriously, like a minute ago. I did two resets with the patches. Shiny patch just appeared again. Another shiny Nidorino. And I uh, <laughs> actually did switch Derpy out this time. So, um, I'm going to hit him with a Super Fang. That's well known. Maybe I'll get poisoned. If I do, I already know he's got Poison Point. 
Okay, well, it's only a 30% chance that that would work anyway. Let's chuck a Pokeball. Well, the first one caught so easy, I'm just going to assume that after I Super Fang to this guy, he's going to be a pretty easy catch. One. Nope. This one's going to be a fighter. You know, I guess the quiet nature on the last one isn't that bad for Nido King. It's just I'd rather him be a physical attacker. One, two, three. There we go. All right. Now I've only got two open slots in my party, or I uh, came in with two open slots. So um, that last Nido Reno was my fifth slot. This is my sixth one. So after this, if he does not have Poison Point, um. I mean, if he has Poison Point, heck, what am I talking about? <laughs> Give a nickname. I'll not now. I, well, let's see. No shiny patch. You gotta be kidding, because um, you know, shiny Nidorinos, they just pop up like nobody's business. All right, this patch is safe to run in unless I go about that far. So, remember that in the future. Let's take a look. Right here is Rex, the first one. I'll probably just rename the one I want Rex anyway when I'm done. He was the quiet capable of taking hits. All right, we got a quirky good endurance. That's pretty cool. Poison point. Uh, okay, well, <laughs> um, that's good. That's not. <laughs> I mean, that's really good for fighting. It's just, um... I'm just so paranoid. I'm pro I might just end up taking this guy, uh, depending on how their stats compare. Hmm. Kind of interesting. I'd have to use an IV checker to really check, but um, those stats were uh, kind of different. Well, um, I guess I'm going to look for another one. But if I catch one more, I'm not going to know if it's got poison point or not. But since they're showing up, you know, constantly, so I might as well. <laughs> it, it, it wasn't even two minutes this time. They're, they're just everywhere. <laughs> Another shiny Nidorino. Sure, why not? Okay, I'll take another one. Let's try this again. And, you know, I'm, I'm starting to think um, Poison Point really might that might not be that horrible for catching Shinies, because, um, well, first of all, most Legendaries that I'd be going for, actually, I think all of the Legendaries I'd be going for would just be using Special Attacks, so Poison Point couldn't affect them. And if I'm going for a Wild one, I'd probably just be chucking Ultra Balls every turn anyway, and if they seriously did get poisoned, it would only help me, because then they would have a status effect on them. That was pretty close. Ow. One, two, three. Yeah. Now, unfortunately, I cannot check this one until I go back to the box. So I'm going to have to make a another video um, later showing this Nidorino and possibly even another one after this because they're so easy to find, it seems. Like, they've been a minute or two apart each time. They're supposed to take you about a half hour to an hour to find a shiny patch after you got the chain of 40. So since this is so ridiculously easy, I might as well keep going. Until one of them shows up that's, like, really difficult, then I'll be like, alright, I'm done with this. Um, again, I'm not gonna nickname him, I'm just gonna switch the, uh, Rex nickname over to whichever one I decide on. So, not right now. Let's see if we got a shiny patch, because, I mean, bet we do. No. <laughs> okay. But, um, I can run in this row. Alrighty. Looking for a part four. Well, here I am again. 
Um, well, uh, this one took a little longer, like, you know, five minutes. What is wrong with these neat arenas? <laughs> They're just like, oh, um, I feel like being shiny. I'm shiny too. Hey, I'm shiny. Twinkle, yeah, I'm shiny. And they're just everywhere. This is like one of the craziest chains I've ever been on. For um, odds for these things appearing. I'm kind of worried that um, two shiny patches are going to appear at once. It's not really a bad thing if that happened. It's just... um. It's like the closest to ever having a shiny Pokemon die that uh, I've ever been through. And, yep, got him again. Still can't uh, check these guys yet. So, he's just going to get sent to my box. Yada yada. No thanks. And do we have another shiny patch? We don't. So I'm up here. Um, I'm gonna go for another one because they're just so easy to find right now. <laughs> You'd think by now my karma would catch up, and you know I'd finally have one that would take me about an hour to get. Nope, fifteen minutes. Got another shiny patch. The fifth shining Nidorino. All right, so this is since this is really getting um, out of hand, I'm gonna quit while I'm winning, and I'm gonna break my chain after this. Let me just catch him really quick, and there's another poison point guaranteed. So a uh, good thing I got five. I don't know if I want the poison point or not. At this point, I'm really debating. I I might actually go for it. Anyway. Um, well, let's pokeball him. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Nope. I've just seen so many videos um, of people going after legendaries, uh, specifically with like Parasect and um, Effect Spore, ends up killing the legendary shiny. So I'm paranoid for using a Pokemon that has even the slimmest chance of accidentally killing the Pokemon. Hmm. He might actually kill Derby. Because I'm not healing him. Hmm. 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 And he didn't kill Derpy. And I might um rename the one I go for um Agua Rex. Just add something in front of the Rex, make it sound a little cool. Cause he's blue and he's a Needle King. Well, he will be a Needle King. Let's see if we found um yet another shiny patch. Just nope. But that there should be a Nidorino. So, we're going to switch Rex, the first one. Oops, I hit summary. The Weehee is awesome. We're going to switch him with the Derp up front. Break the chain, possibly. Uh, let's see. Nope, it is a Nidorino. So, here we go. Regular Nidorino. Shiny Nidorino. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Alrighty, now that the chain is concluded, I'm back in the box, and we're going to take a look at all these Nidorinos lined up, figure out who is the chosen one. Here's our first one. We already saw him. He was the quiet nature with poison point. And the next one was the quirky nature with poison point. The next one we captured that we never got to see is a bashful, which is also um, a neutral nature. Awesome. Another poison point. So uh, that's good. I, at least I get to compare some stats because I'm 
I might actually pick Poison Point at this point. Hasty, so that's a, that's a quick one. Another Poison Point, and we already know the last one. Well, I know the... it's a Gentle. And another Poison Point. So, every single Nidorino I got had Poison Point. Seriously? <laughs> oh well, uh, rivalry, rivalry, um, does kind of stink, so, whatever. Um, he's not going to be helpful for getting Pokemon who have physical attacks, but he's going to be pretty awesome when it comes to actually fighting in that game, uh, so that would be pretty slick. Um, he'll at least be able to know Super Fang. Well, I'm going to go through the IVs, figure out which is the ideal one, uh, according to their natures as well. And I'm going to pick one to send to the all-shining game. Alright. Awesome.